Um, Garth, just to start off with, I think the last time you're probably in a cup final was the Gold Cup. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, a little bit of a, a step up this time, but uh, you do have a bit of experience in a big knockout competition. Yeah, definitely. Uh, I played in a Gold Cup final, which was, I think it was a long time, two years ago. Mm. Yeah, but definitely, Curry Cup's definitely a step up. Uh, we're looking forward to the weekend. And yeah, excited. What's the, the mood in the camp? Um, obviously, a lot of youngsters around, uh, a lot of guys who haven't played in any type of final. Uh, any nerves or are you guys keeping under control? Yeah, we, guys, there's, def there's definitely nerves. There's definitely nerves, but obviously the senior guys, of guys who've been there, Odwa, Keegan, uh, try to keep the guys under control, settle the nerves. But obviously, uh, the guys who haven't played in the final before was excited for it. And yeah, looking forward. And must be good that it's a home final as well. Uh, yeah. Makes quite a big difference. Yeah, definitely. I think we've been playing the whole season to, to get a home semi final, and now we're home final. We're very excited to, to play in front of our fans. We've, it's been great the whole season, so yeah, it's been good. Garth, is there a feeling that you guys have put in so much hard work? Now just one more hurdle and, and then it's mission accomplished. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. I think we've been working so hard for the last 13 weeks yeah. to, to, to be in a, a Curry Cup final in front of our own fans. And obviously, uh, we've been playing in a Super Rugby quarter final to be in a Curry Cup final. Mm -hmm. is, it's huge for us yeah. uh, in terms of we haven't, uh, haven't played in a knockout um, um, or the semi-final for the last two years. So yeah, it's definitely a, a big step up for us. What can you take out of the last game against Western Province? Yeah, I thought I thought we we uh, we started very well against Province. Uh, I think in the second half we relaxed a bit more. I think they came at us because mm -hmm. they, they actually got a lot to play for in that game. I think they defended very well. I think we couldn't we couldn't keep the ball for long phases. Um, yeah, so so yeah, I think for us we just need to be patient this weekend. They defensively they very well. We must just keep the ball and, and yeah, the the, the tries and the, the score line will look after itself. So as exciting as it is to be in a final, it's also about composure and just being patient. Eh? Yeah, that comes down to the, the, obviously the guys <laughs> who've played there before. So for for the guys we haven't, I think just to keep calm and do do what we've been doing the last 13 weeks, it's been working for us. So yeah, obviously the word final comes in. So so I think we must just go, um, stay composed and, and, and stay positive. Uh, from the semi-final, do you feel the intensity difference from uh, group stages to, to knockout? Yeah, well, yeah. obviously it's knockout, so there's, uh, there's a bit more intensity. I think there's a bit more pressure on you. So yeah, I think there's, there's a, a huge difference between the semi-final and the, and the group stages. So. Is there, there's a sense that you guys are the favourites being at home, having the group stages that you did. Does that add any other pressure or is it actually quite a good thing to have? No, I think I think it's a good thing to have. The thing is we don't want to put uh, pressure on ourselves. I think we haven't won anything yet, so there's nothing to lose. Um, uh, I think, like like we said before, playing in, in front of our own fans and our own crowd, we, we just want to enjoy it. We just want to focus on what we're doing. I think whoever we play in the final, obviously it's Western Province, it's irrelevant who we play. We just want to focus on, on, on what we want to do. Have you guys done your homework on the Western Province backline? They're quite exciting out wide as well. Yeah, yeah, Province has always been exciting. Uh, their backline always been good out wide. I think for the last few weeks they they actually a bit more defensive driven. I think at the start of the season they were throwing the ball around a bit more, but closer to, to the knockouts they, they they actually a bit defensive driven. Yeah, but like I said, we just want to focus on what we want to do. Uh, it's real, irrelevant what they what they gonna do or what they does. So for us, it's just about us. Yeah. Garth, but, uh, I mean, uh, I hear what you're saying, but uh, obviously uh, the way Robert Dupree played last last time, obviously uh, he's a he's a guy who, if you let him play, can... Yeah, 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 definitely. Rob played very well the last game. Uh, I think, like I said, in the second half, we we were we were they were chasing the game, so they got all to play for. I think, yeah, definitely, Rob had a good game. Yeah, but uh, I, I don't know what to say anymore. I think for us, it's just to keep calm, do what we want to do, do what we've been done for the last 13 weeks, and yeah, the, the result will look after itself. Perfect. Cool. And just well, lastly, um, Spoo obviously missing out this weekend through injury. Pretty unlucky. He's had an amazing season. Possibly the player of the season. Sad yeah, to see him miss yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, it's very sad to see Spoo miss out. I think he had an amazing season. He's been very, very good for us. Yeah, to miss out on a final like that is it's very sad. But I'm sure he will, he will get back up.